Selecting your next high school math course is a very personalized decision. Beyond Algebra 1, Geometry, and Algebra 2, there are over 15 math courses to choose from. So how do you know which one is right for you? You should consider future career or college interests, as well as high school diploma requirements. Are you interested in a future career in STEM, science, technology, engineering, and mathematics? Maybe you want a future in computer science or statistics. Or perhaps you are working towards a career in the liberal arts and need more of a technical foundation in mathematics. We have math course options based upon each of these math strands. On the next slide, we will review a detailed math pathway chart with denoted strands based on college or career interests that will help you decide. This high school mathematics course sequence guide shows possible pathways for our students. There are several items to be aware of when reviewing these pathways. Students may take AFTA immediately after Algebra 1 or Geometry. However, if a student takes AFTA after Algebra 1, they most, must take Geometry next in the sequence. Students can take Data Science or AFTA, Algebra 2, or Algebra 2 Trig after successfully completing Geometry. Data Science can be taken either before or after taking AFTA, Algebra 2, or Algebra 2 Trig. AFTA, Algebra 2, and Algebra 2 Trig are all courses that cover varied levels of Algebra 2 content. We will discuss the details and prerequisites for each of these courses later in this video. We have identified four math strands based upon student future career and college interests. The four strands are quantitative reasoning, STEM, statistics, and computer science. Each strand has a corresponding icon. We have listed at the bottom of this chart the icons for each strand and a general listing of careers and college fields of study. Please be aware this is, this is not an exhaustive list. For more information regarding future careers and planning for what comes next after high school graduation, please go to wjccschools.org backslash parents, backslash school links. Students need strong math foundations to meet their college and career goals. Let's review the math foundation courses available to students in high school. For a standard diploma, students will need a, to earn a total of three math credits in high school. Out of these three math credits, at least two selections must be from Algebra 1, Geometry, AFTA, or Algebra 2. A computer science course credit can be considered as a math credit. In the Algebra 1 course, students are provided a strong foundation for academic mathematics. This course will establish a working understanding of the terminology, notations, and symbolism of algebra. Algebra 1 Lab course is recommended for students identified as needing more support. Students enrolled in this course will take the Algebra 1 Standards of Learning Assessment in the spring. The Geometry course includes the deductive axiomatic method of proof to justify theorems and tell whether conclusions are valid. Emphasis is placed on two- and three-dimensional reasoning skills coordinate and transformational geometry, and the use of geometric models to solve problems. Geometry Lab course is recommended for students needing more support. Students enrolled in this course will take the Geometry Standards of Learning Assessment in the spring. The prerequisite for Geometry is Algebra 1. Our Algebra, Functions, and Data Analysis course, also known as AFTA, is recommended to prepare students for the Algebra 2 course and can be taken before or after geometry. Through mathematical modeling and data analysis, students will study functions and their behaviors, 
systems of inequalities, probability, and experimental design and impl implementation. There is no standards of learning assessment taken in AFTA, and the prerequisite is Algebra 1. Future career and college areas of study are listed at the bottom of this page. No handheld calculators are necessary for these courses. Students will use in class and on the state assessments the same free online Desmos calculator. WJCC offers many advanced math courses for students. For an advanced diploma, students will earn a total of four math credits. Courses shall include at least three selections from Algebra 1, Geometry, Algebra 2, or other math courses above the level of Algebra 2. A computer science course credit may be considered a math credit. Algebra 2 will cover advanced mathematical and algebraic concepts at a moderate pace. Topics include linear equations and inequalities, functions, systems of equations and inequalities, polynomials, conics, and polynomial functions. It is recommended that students have at least a C average in Algebra 1 and Geometry before proceeding to Algebra 2. Some students in this course will take the Algebra 2 Standards of Learning Assessment in the spring. The Algebra 2 lab course is recommended for students needing more support, and the prerequisite for Algebra 2 is geometry. Algebra 2 Trig is an advanced compact course including Algebra 2 and Trig concepts. This course moves at an accelerated pace and provides the foundation for students to pursue advanced placement level courses. An advanced math background is required for this course. Some students in this course will take the Algebra 2 Standards of Learning Assessment in the spring, and the prerequisite for Algebra 2 Trig is geometry. Element elementary Functions Trig is a course for the college-bound student who may or may not pursue math at the highest level. It provides an in-depth understanding of trig concepts and prepares students for advanced math courses such as math analysis and calculus. The prerequisite for this course is Algebra 2. The math analysis or pre-calculus course is for mathematical mathematically capable students who plan to continue in a field that emphasizes mathematics, science, engineering, etc. This course is an abstract theoretical approach to formal mathematics that extends and unifies algebra, geometry, and trigonometry through analysis. This course is the prerequisite for all advanced calculus courses and is required for admission to governor school. The prerequisite for this course is Algebra 2 Trig or Elementary Functions Trig. Future career or college areas of study are listed at the bottom of this page. Students will use in class and on state assessments the free online Desmos calculator. However, some of these advanced math courses will require students to use a TI-84 graphing calculator. Data science is a new math course and is a unique study of statistics and computer science. Data scientists are problem solvers and strategists with a common goal, to use the data information to make a positive impact on future outcomes. Data science is structured into problem-based learning modules. Technology will help students navigate the data cycle of mining, cleaning, visualizing, analyzing, and modeling to tell a story. Students will complete collaborative mini-projects throughout the semester to showcase their understandings. Students will develop the following life, life skills, Excel spreadsheets, data coding tools, digital data visualizations, project management, and effective communication.
the prerequisite for data science is geometry. For more information about this course, scan the QR code to watch the video. Future career or college areas of studies are listed at the bottom of this page. Probability and statistics are the study of experimental design, statistical inference, and probability. Statistics is the most widely application branch of mathematics. Any student who has passed Algebra 2 may enroll in Probability and Statistics or AP Statistics. The AP Statistics curriculum involves deeper discovery of concepts and higher standards are placed on student products. In our Probability and Statistics course, students will learn how to conduct their own statistical experiments, analyze the results with graphs and probability, and interpret their findings. The course focuses on the applications of probability, statistics, and logic in business, industry, science, and government, and provides practical preparation for a wide variety of career fields. The prerequisite is AFTA or Algebra II. Advanced Placement Statistics is a college-level introductory class in statistics. Students focus on the major concepts and tools for collecting, analyzing, and reaching conclusions from data. The four main themes of this course are exploring data, planning a study, anticipating patterns, and making statistical inferences. This course is an excellent foundation for students pursuing careers in science, social science, mathematics, business, or engineering. Written communication of statistical analysis is emphasized. The prerequisite is Algebra II, and students have the opportunity to earn college credit by taking the College Board AP exam in May. Future career or college areas of studies are listed at the bottom of this page. Calculus is the mathematical study of continuous change. We offer several levels of calculus for our students. In our high school calculus course, students investigate fundamentals of the mathematics of change with limits, differentiation, and integration. Students will strengthen their understanding of foundations as they study problems from geometric, numerical, and algebraic viewpoints. Applications relate derivatives and integrals to a variety of real-world situations. This course includes extensive use of graphing calculators, and the prerequisite is math analysis. There are two advanced placement calculus courses to select from. In advanced placement calculus AB, Students will explore concepts, methods, and applications of differential and in integral calculus. This course explores theoretical basis and problem solving in calculus. Students taking this course should have a solid understanding of algebra functions, trigonometry, and pre-calculus. Students are prepared for the AP Calculus AB exam in May, and the prerequisite is math analysis. In Advanced Placement Calculus BC, students will explore applications of differential and integral calculus and additional topics required beyond the AP Calculus AB content. Students taking this course should have a solid understanding in algebra functions, trigonomet trigonomic functions, and precalculus. Students are prepared for the AP Calculus BC exam in May, and the prerequisite is math analysis. Both of these courses include extensive, extensive use of graphing calculators. Future career and college areas of study are listed at the bottom of this page.